Hey guys and welcome to another Grow With Dan. Today we're inside and we're going to be making an organic hydroponic setup. Some of the things you're going to need to use for this video is a black hose. You're going to use three foot. You can see it's a smaller, I think it's one quarter inch or something like that. We're going to use the air stone that matches it. We're also going to use some scissors. We're going to use an air pump. To pump the air into the system the air stone will actually separate it into tiny bubbles and then we're also going to be using a Folgers container which we'll show you in a second we're going to be cutting this out to set our whole system in so uh, give me a second guys we're going to set this up all right guys super easy the reason we use the Folgers is because these actually fit perfect if you see this ring you can kind of see it in here all you have to do is cut out that ring and the Folgers thing will hold it in perfect. So we're gonna do that and then be right back to show you. All right guys, welcome back. Now um, the hole's been cut, so let's take this out. The net pot fits perfect in there. As you can see, we use the exact circle. Fits perfect, easy to do. Just cut it right out and bam. Um, the next thing you want to see is that we put the hose that's attached to the air pump right through the side. And it's very important to make sure that it goes through the actual red part of the container so that you can take this off if you need to. And it stays. There's no, uh, don't try and go to the top. Um, now that you can see that, you can see the air pump is pushing air through the stone. The stone actually makes little tiny bubbles which will uh, circulate the water and put air into it. So when the roots go down there, it's going to get a bunch of air and water at the same time. So our setups are, the very first setup is a true hydroponic setup and this will be set straight in. It's got the hydroton clay pebbles at the bottom which will sit inside the water and then it'll wick up to the rest of this and then we will uh, be actually feeding the plant the same way you would feed a normal organic plant so the food's going to be normal with organic but it's also going to be getting a lot of water so the teacher won't have to um, worry about watering the plants anymore so this will be a hydroponic setup but we're still going to feed it like organic the second setup is a true organic hydroponic setup where you use uh, all perlite at the top and then it's cocoa which was our the plant was already in we basically just put a plant in there that we've been growing in cocoa and then we added perlite this is going to sit right over the water it'll never touch the water the roots will grow into the water and get hundred percent purified water and then we'll feed the plant just like a regular organic plant so those are the setups you guys got to see how it was made i hope you liked it until next time guys keep growing